saying right, does it? Now, there's no doubt social media is a powerful tool. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, each a way of voicing our opinions and sharing photos. But for some users, it's shot them to instant fame. Take this 16-year-old Adelaide school student. She's done nothing out of the ordinary, yet is commanding attention from followers all over the world. Amy Torber looks at what's made her such a hit. <coughs> Instagram has just, yeah, it's gone off and it's changed everything. Instagram makes it incredibly easy for everyday people to become famous for doing nothing. When you have girls, heaps of girls talking about it, they, the word tends to go out. This is Poppy Radbone's real life. Pretty good for just 16, but is it enough to make her famous? I notice that when I'm walking down the street, just shopping, you know, have girls like behind me or pointing at me. And yeah, so it's kind of, yeah, really unexpected. She doesn't act or sing, but she knows what captures her generation's attention. Instagram. It's mainly just for photos. So when people follow you, they can just see it on the news feed and it has so many different effects and you can play around with it and make it look different. And in the Insta world, Poppy is Insta famous. If you feel like you've got a cool outfit on or you're in a cool, you know, place to take a photo, just take it. Creating and distributing the photos is the first step towards instant celebrity, says Jess Galletley from the Adelaide Confidential. You no longer need to try to get on television in, um, order, in order to be recognised on the street. People just need to have an iPhone or a tablet. To me, Poppy's pops and, you know, what I see is probably quite different to what other people see or how they perceive us. Proud mum Tori was surprised by the attention, but now helps to ensure every post is picture perfect. That one's cool. Which one? Um, yeah. I have fun doing it with her, so she certainly gives me a hard time about taking the right photos. <laughs> We have to take probably 20 shots to get one good one. Poppy has a purpose behind her portraiture, that is to launch her fashion line, It's Poppy. I designed it last year, um, had my launch at my house and it's been really popular. I think Instagram's really good advertising and yeah, people are on Instagram, I think more than Facebook these days. Fame wasn't what I wanted from this. I just wanted to help people, whether it was, you know, two people or a thousand people, as long as I can help someone. Like Poppy, another Adelaide girl, Kayla Estinas, is proving the app is a career pathway. I've gone from being a personal trainer, um, being a mobile personal trainer, to having Instagram to upload these transformations, to having a flood of girls wanting to um, train with me. It was the before and after of Kayla's clients that struck a chord online. One day I was walking and my phone just kept beeping and beeping and beeping and I, I, um, I opened it and I realised one of the pages I followed uploaded my photo and uploaded one of my transformations. Hundreds turned into thousands and before long, one million. Every day I log on and there's 2,000 new people, 3,000 new people, it's just amazing. People not only want to follow Kayla, they want to look like her. I couldn't run like a million girl boot camp or and everyone is from everywhere so that's originally why I created the ebooks and the healthy eating lifestyle plan. And the Insta fame has become the real thing. At first um, I was shocked that people recognised me. But for Poppy is life as glamorous as it appears. I'm just a normal school gouge doing what I love. Well, this is my Scotch formal dress on my own school formal. It's been the most popular dress on my Instagram. This is another formal dress that I got made for the PAC formal. My friends don't, like, just see me as myself and they don't really take notice of it. Best friends Jessica and Sophie are supportive but agree it comes with baggage. When we go out just for coffee or something, everyone's always looking at us at parties. Everyone comes up, <laughs> says hi, Bobby. It's pretty hard. <laughs> she's definitely South Australia's um, fashion, but she's the fashion icon of now. She's done so well for herself at such a young age, and like she has a like massive followers, and like, I'm sure lots of people get jealous.
like I can notice that girls would be talking about it behind my back and you don't you just they're always going to do that people that are jealous so whether you're out to inspire or push your own agenda all it takes is that phone in your hand i think they could rather kim kardashian <laughs> everyone should have a social media account everyone should have um some sort of blog and we'll be back with more right after this <laughs>